Hi there. Today I want to introduce Colleen McNamee from McNamee Mediations. And Colleen McNamee is somebody I've had on the show now a few times. And I've been so impressed with what she does for a living and how many people she's helped. I wanted to invite her on and, and really get to know Colleen a little bit more and find out what drives you and what built your practice to be as successful as it is. So welcome again, Colleen. Thank you. They get really frustrated with amounts of child support and they're wondering, they feel like, you know, the wife is going to go live this grandiose lifestyle now and he's going to be left living in a cardboard box just trying to make ends meet. Orange County in general has a high divorce rate. Um, I'm wondering if the age plays a part at all or the, the two things I want to kind of try and look at is um, do younger people tend to get divorced quicker, I guess, or get divorced versus older people when you get married at a later uh, age? And I feel like their goal is to just punish the other party. I'll tell them that they're not a good candidate for mediation at this point. And oftentimes they end up coming back after they either have cooled down a little bit or they've hired separate attorneys, litigated, spent a ton of money, and their case is nowhere being completed. And they've had, you know, some of the steam has kind of blown off. What is mediation? How does it differ from litigation? So in mediation, you as the couple come in and you jointly retain me to represent both of you rather than um, retaining independent attorneys. So we don't have independent attorneys typically in a mediation situation. I'm working with the couple as a neutral facilitator and I'm an advocate for both parties. So sometimes people will say, well, do I need my own attorney to make sure that my rights are being protected? Your rights are being protected by working with me. I'm just protecting both of you equally. It's kind of a, a give and take and that's sort of how we do the negotiating. Oddly, or not so oddly, I would say that the leading cause for divorce, in my opinion, and the experiences I've had with my clients, is a breakdown in communication, which goes right hand in hand with what Jeff is saying. And I think that, that the breakdown in communication can manifest itself in issues with finances. It can also manifest itself in seeking attention elsewhere, and that would lead to affairs. Are you ready for some more staggering numbers? Well, you told me these already. <laughs> so yeah, why don't you tell everybody else? Because these are crazy numbers. Okay. So I did a little more research just to see kind of the numbers that had come in for 2013. And in California, the average contested or litigated divorce cost $100,000 per party. Primarily, I would say that most people will call me and say, I think we can agree on things, but we just don't want to spend a lot of money on two separate attorneys. We've heard it's really expensive and we would rather have the money left over for our children's college fund or for us to be able to start our new lives individually. The um, program is geared towards women at this point and it's women contemplating going through divorce or legal separation or currently going through a divorce or legal separation. And it really is just a great way for them to come in and have their questions answered for a very nominal registration fee. And then I also offer something called a premarital workshop, which is unique because I address things from a legal perspective rather than a psychological perspective on how to avoid legal obstacles that could arise down the road once you get married. You know, truly I, I was nervous. I had no idea what I was walking into, but uh, it was great. It was, a, it was a table, Colleen was in the middle, um, my ex-wife on one end, me at the other. It was very professional, but it was also kind of a relaxed atmosphere. I don't know, Colleen's personality um, helped it to be that way, it was it was comfortable. It wasn't, you know, as scary as I thought. Um, and she does. She she lays it out. She lets you know that she's there for both of you. 